is going on, y'all? Happy motherfucking Thursday to everybody out there. You know, I was just happened to be scrolling through Twitter, through the Drake and the Pusha T, Pusha T stuff, and everybody talking about how Pusha T exposed Drake having a side baby and all the other things that he has. And here's my thing with the side baby. Is it really a secret baby or the media just doesn't know about it? The fans don't know about it because here's the thing. Drake's never been one of those people that exposes his personal life in the media anyway. He's, he he kind of has that, you know, that if you see me with it, then, that's, then so be it. You know, he'll address something at an award show, but he'll never get on social media. He, he kind of has that Beyonce perplex. Like, okay, my personal life is my personal life. My uh, entertainment life is my entertainment life. Okay, so here's my thing. What if Drake does have a side baby and he goes, who's to say that he goes and takes care of the baby and he, you know, sends the mom money? Now, with that, I know the blogs were reporting that Drake, um, pays for the baby. I hope he does not just send the mom money for the baby because I'm not with that financial parents and shit. I'm not a fan of shit like that. Um, but all this Drake and Pusha T stuff and all the this, the beef and shit. Honestly, I haven't sat down and listened to this shit because I'm just like, okay, you know, like, see, beefs these days, it's all about the social media shit, who can be trending on social media for 24 to 48 hours. And then it's like, okay, like, being that done, it's not like beefs back in the day where motherfuckers came for everybody's whole entire existence family and i guess push the t did do that but today beefs just feel like a whole bunch of speculation and gossip you know what i'm saying back in the day motherfuckers will come for your ugly child your ugly mama you know everything so with the drake and push a t situation i'm just kind of like eh, yeah i don't know i might sit this one out or whatever and i'm a fan of drake um, but I just feel like in beefs these days, and here's another another point I'm going to make. The other person is usually the one that's less famous than the person they're going against. As Pusha T, you know, Drake is on top right now when it got hits on Billboard. And Pusha T, not so necessarily. He doesn't, I mean, the streets know about Pusha T, but Billboard really doesn't. He's not known to the general public like Drake is. Like Drake... You can go to your white friends and they'll know a Drake song. You ask somebody white about Pusha T, they're going to be like, who? And then you might tell them, oh, remember the guy he was in the clips? They had the grinding and they might be like, oh, yeah, okay. They're only going to know him because something he did in the past since people know who Drake is now for what he's doing now. So I just feel like Pusha T is the one who really, he's, it, it, it goes back to what happened with Remy Ma and Nicki Minaj last year. You know, Remy released that seven minute diss track and old people was hyping it up. It was like number one on the rap iTunes charts. People like drama. People like shit like that. They like disses and exposing people like that. But in the long run, it gets you nowhere because people are just hyping you up for the, the moment. And then they go back to the hotter artists like Nicki Drop Music, Chun Li just went gold. Uh, Remy Ma dropped a couple singles, but ain't nobody buying it. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, this beef and shit, like, really, you know, it'll blow over. Drake will drop his album. People will go buy it, and then we'll be back on Drake shit again. Right now, people are going in on Drake about the black face or whatever, and I know he released a statement. I've seen that picture a long time ago, and I remember when it came out, and I remember reading an article about what he's saying now. It was about... um black actors not being able to get casted or whatever so yeah I, I i had already knew that when the picture came out but that's what rap is about you're supposed to expose your opponent and make your opponent look like you know racist whatever conf you know whatever you can come up with them but uh yeah um i don't know what drake's gonna come back with but i guess we'll have to sit and see um, but as far as that side baby goes, that side baby situation, I'm just waiting to see what the baby mama's gonna say if they gonna if she's gonna have an interview somewhere, 
or Drake's gonna come out and be like, uh, yeah, I do have a baby. I didn't know there was anybody's anybody's business who exposed the fact that I had a baby. Um, so I guess all we can do is wait and find out. But um, yeah, it's Thursday, so it's like catch up day. Um, I don't know what I'm getting here and talk to y'all about, but I'm gonna get in here and talk to y'all about some shit today. Um, shit is always racing through my mind, and I want to catch up with y'all. It's been a long time since I actually sat down and talked about some shit with y'all. Drop down and let me know what you guys think about the um the side baby with Drake. Whose side are you on? Are you on Pusha T side? Are you on Drake side? Or do have you do you even care? Me personally, I don't care. I feel like I like Drake. Um Drake, I feel like he drops too many albums at one time and he kind of like, but I guess he can. He's living off of the moment, so I don't blame him, but he drops a lot of music. So I haven't even, I haven't made it past, let me see, what was that album before? Whatever the album was before Views, I haven't listened to, to or maybe I'm, yeah, Anything Drake has dropped after views, I haven't paid it any mind because I still be trying to. I think artists should live off of an album for two, like a year or two. Him, he'll go like six months, oh, dropping another album. And I'm like, okay, Drake, you know, cool, so be it. But I just can't keep up. Um, But yeah, like I said, drop down and let me know what do you guys think about Drake and his side, baby? Whose side are you on? Are you on Drake? Are you on Pusha T side? Let's talk about it. It's Thursday. Come on, let's get it. It's deeper than rap. We talking character. Let me keep with the facts. You are hiding a child. Let that boy come home. Deadbeat motherfucker playing border patrol. Ooh. Adonis is your son. And he deserves more than an Adidas press run. That's real. Love that baby. Respect that girl. Forget she's a porn star. Let her be your world. Yeah. How dare you put yay in my verses. I'm selfish. I want all of the curse. I'm pre-booking the churches, me versus three hearses If we all go to hell, it'll be worth it Already aligned with the greats And on that same note, the only ones I chase are two ghosts Still giving you classics, that's the only thing that dates me Over your 40, hunched over like he 80 Tick, 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 how much time he got that man is Six, 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 I got the devil flow, nigga Six, 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 surgical summer with it Snip, 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 and you don't really want it with him Surgical Summer Volume 1 We gonna take this slow